Princess Eugenie and her husband Jack Brooksbank are picture perfect. The granddaughter of Queen Elizabeth is looking back at her sweet engagement to her husband Jack. The 30-year-old world shared a never-before-seen snap to her Instagram on Tuesday, where she and her love are all smiles at their 2018 engagement announcement. She captioned the pic, quote, This time three years ago. Flashback to such a happy moment when Jack and I announced our engagement. Jack's proposal was definitely fit for royalty. The couple shared their happy news in a televised BBC interview back in January 2018, and the princess gushed over their romantic engagement. Uh, we had a beautiful volcano summer setting. Uh, birds are flying. Yeah. As would say. <laughs> yeah, the lake was so beautiful. It was like the light was just a special light that I've never seen. I actually said, this is an incredible moment. And, um, and then he got the question, <laughs> which was really surprising, even though we've been together seven years. So right. <laughs> I, was, um, I was over the moon. The lovebirds might be looking back at their precious memories, but they also have a lot to look forward to. The world shared last September that she is expecting her first child. At the time, she wrote alongside her Instagram post, quote, Jack and I are so excited for early 2021. The pair are clearly excited to welcome their little kiddo into the world family. The baby will be the first grandchild for Prince Andrew and Sarah Ferguson, Duchess of York, and will mark Queen Elizabeth and Prince Philip's ninth great-grandchild. And Fergie is over the moon to be a grandma. She gushed over the soon-to-be parents and her future grandbaby on her Instagram in September, writing, quote, I am so excited by the news that Eugenie and Jack are expecting their first child. Thrilled for them both. And in my 60th year, cannot wait to be a grandmother. Welcoming a new baby into the York family is going to be a moment of profound joy. The new baby will clearly be surrounded by love. And it sounds like we're not too far away from meeting the future world.